5,000 years ago. The flame of civilization was lit on this land in the east. Yellow Emperor, the cultural ancestor of the Chinese, commenced the splendid Chinese civilization. This is Henan, home of Yellow Emperor, the eastern end of the ancient Silk Road, and the homeland for all Chinese. A land with a rich history nourished by the Yellow River. Henan saw the development of China's first capital city, first written scripts, and the earliest commercial activities. Henan boasts four of the eight ancient Chinese capitals and all of the four great inventions of ancient China. Home to six world cultural heritage sites, Henan shares its wealth of human wisdom with the rest of the world. The well-known Shaolin Kung Fu and Chen style Tai Chi help promote the cultural exchanges between China and other countries. 2,000 years ago, a 36-member diplomatic mission led by Ban Chao reopened the Silk Road. 1,000 years ago, a convoy of camels loaded with goods, as depicted in the panoramic painting along the river during the Qingming Festival, entered Kaifeng, the capital of the Northern Song Dynasty. Today, China is working toward national rejuvenation opening a new page in its history. Under the Belt and Road Initiative proposed by President Xi Jinping, the ancient Silk Road is taking on a new life. And Henan is developing at China speed. Henan has the densest motorway networks in China, a multimodal transport system, China's first star-shaped high-speed railway network, and the first 350 km per hour high-speed railway hub in Asia. Zhengzhou Airport became one of the world's top 50 airports in terms of mail and cargo throughput in 2017. Cherries from Chile, known as Red Treasure and fresh with the southern sunlight, travel all the way across the Pacific by chartered planes and reach Chinese tables just 28 hours after they are harvested. German beer and Dutch dairy products are delivered conveniently from Zhengzhou to millions of Chinese households. Just like Zhengzhou itself, it has grown uh, faster than we expected. Uh, we did not have a second hub. The dual hub means Zhengzhou is our only other hub. There are 18 flights each week between Zhengzhou and Luxembourg alone. Cargo air routes are now linking Zhengzhou and 34 cities of other countries, serving as a silk road in the air. China Railway Express has eight trains traveling between Europe and Zhengzhou every week, delivering goods from 24 countries in Asia and Europe. Zhengzhou's cargo train service, as part of the Silk Road by land, has the highest cargo value in China. Henan was the first in China to establish a bonded zone model of customs clearance for cross-border e-commerce. By clearing 500 applications a second, Henan ranks number one nationwide in cross-border e-commerce. An online Silk Road with a global reach is taking shape here. With the three Silk Roads, Henan will enjoy a more favorable position as a transportation hub. Zhengzhou, the provincial capital, is one of the national central cities. It has established the first national level pilot airport economic zone. One of every seven smartphones in the world is made in Zhengzhou. 
Zhengzhou Xinjiang Comprehensive Bonded Zone ranks the first in China in terms of trade volume. With investment from 127 of the Fortune 500 companies, Henan is experiencing vibrant growth through international cooperation. At the construction site of Thompson East Coastline in Singapore, a world-leading rectangular tunnel boring machine is working in full speed. With this and many other products of independent innovation, China Railway Engineering Equipment Group, CREG, is reaching out to the world. At Sino Iron in Australia, the largest mills in the world are operating vigorously. Citic Heavy Industries is making its name in the international market. In Europe, new energy buses with the Yutong logo are running on streets of Paris and London. Yutong buses are sold with a large volume to more than 30 countries and regions. In Tajikistan, a Henan company is introducing high-quality varieties of wheat, corn, and cotton in a demonstration farm it has helped to build. Over the past four decades, Henan's economy has grown significantly. Its GDP increased by 70 times from 9.5 billion US dollars in 1978 to 666.3 billion in 2017. This is the best of times. At the new starting point of high quality growth and guided by Xi Jinping thoughts on socialism with Chinese characteristics for a new era, Henan is transforming from made in Henan to created in Henan. Henan is making every effort to turn itself into a logistics hub that serves the whole nation and connects with the world. Henan is advancing urbanization to make cities and villages more beautiful and help the people achieve their dreams. Guided by the Belt and Road Initiative, this ancient land is brimming with vigor and vitality. And Open Hanan is embracing the world for shared prosperity. Welcome to Hanan.